In our last video, we took a look at the history of consolidation and a timeline of events. I'm Jason Stahl, and in this video, we're going to look at how long the feverish pace of consolidation will last, next in the AirPro Diagnostics Collision Garage. Consolidation has to end at some point, right? It will end, but it won't be anytime soon. The consolidators are all still trying to build their market platforms, and there are many markets that are still untouched. Why do certain markets remain untouched? It goes along with the principle of, if you avoid spreading yourself too thin and focus only on one to three task items at a time, you'll be significantly more successful. The consolidators consequently only focus on a few markets at a time so they can be more effective. They typically evolve off a hub and spoke mentality meaning they start by obtaining or creating a market platform and then expand into new towns off the market platform to complement the existing hub. Usually, the new town they expand into off the hub, depending on density, is 10 to 100 miles from the existing hub. As far as 2023, the bull will continue to charge. How long? It's hard to say considering the challenges of inflation and rising interest rates which at some point will affect consolidators and their activity level. That being said, it's thought that the hard charge will continue for another 24 months and dwindle off within three years. Most if not all consolidators have received and or are getting a fresh new influx of cash and will be ready to buy more shops in 2023. Historically, consolidators typically slow down a bit in November and December to plan and strategize for the coming year. For the second year in a row, that's not happening. Instead, they're laser focused on closing as many deals as they can in 2022 and negotiating new deals for 2023. However, some of the original consolidators have allowed the new kids on the block to take the front seat. Some of these new kids have been making historic deals, deals that had been non-existent before 2022 in certain markets. Some of the quiet new kids who fly under the radar are doing the same thing. We expect this bull market to continue in 2023, even amidst high inflation, staffing challenges, and labor material rate suppression, all with a mad dash to create the biggest, most favorable platforms. The end game for consolidators is return on investment for their investors. That begins and ends with obtaining the most shops with the broadest and robust platform via mergers and acquisitions of shops, single, MSO, and beyond. I'm Jason Stahl from the AirPro Diagnostics Collision Garage. Thanks for watching.